Okay, so I'm here at my sister's farm in Minnesota because I'm out here to visit the family. And uh, this is something that I can do at the drop of a hat because I am single. And not that married people can't just go on vacations and have fun either, but it is one of the perks of being single because I don't have to worry about someone else's timeline or their work schedule or what's going on with them. I just buy a ticket and come on out here. And so I am chilling um, in my single ready to mingle t-shirt, having fun here. And, um, but also I want to make clear that being single doesn't mean that it's just one like 24 seven party and that's all you do is just, you know, consume stuff and use up time and waste your life. Um, being single also has some other great perks and that is the ability to drop what I'm doing at any time and help a friend if I need to, or have someone stay at my place because I have an extra bedroom that's not being used or go on a missions trip and help people and do stuff like that. And it's just really cool because um, as you know, in the previous chapter of the book, I talked about what's hard about being single, but I want to emphasize that there are some pretty rocking things about being single as well. And so embrace those and be ready to understand that God has a story for you wherever you are. And so as you read this chapter, be encouraged, have fun with it, talk it over with your friends, and let me know what you think.